So, you wanna make a flying car, eh? Just like this one? Well, you came to the right place. We're gonna be creating the first ever flying car inside of drive world or well well the second the second ever flying car we're gonna be going over how to make it getting people's reactions and actually competing in races with this crazy car and if you guys haven't guessed it already the car we are gonna be using is the go-kart i mean obviously ever since the go-kart's been added it's just been crazy it's like the most overpowered car inside of drive world and, and apparently now it can fly but anyways let's go ahead and actually head over to the shop so we can purchase the go-kart here it is it's for a nice fifteen thousand dollars i feel like i'm gonna go broke definitely gonna go broke so for fifteen thousand dollars you can get this nice luxurious go-kart has a max power of 24 horsepower and a top speed of 44 miles per hour let's go ahead and select our color and these not really good colors we'll just go with the we'll go with black all right let's go ahead and buy this <sighs> There we go. Here we have it. It's not that fast at all off the start. Hey, this this car sucks. I mean, it can't even fly either. Hold on. We'll get right to it. If we head back into the garage and we go to customize, you want to head over to engine. Now, here is where the most expensive part is going to be. You need at least $600,000 just to max upgrade this all. You have to get everything to the max. Maybe you don't, but I haven't tested it out. We're just wasting money at this point. So, Oh, engine swap 500 <laughs> oh, boom i literally had 27 million earlier today i my god race pistons for 3000 race crank and like i said you just want to get every max upgrade on this the only expensive part is going to be the engine swap so if you can only afford like the v8 engine or v10 i'm pretty sure that'll be fine but there we go we have every single thing upgraded all the way to the max can this thing fly yet but before we see if this thing can actually fly let's take a look at today's sponsors I can't ever find a good Southwest Florida roleplay server. There's just so much FRP everywhere. Hey, you right there. Yeah, stop crying there. I have the perfect server for what you're looking for. Oh yeah. Well, what could that possibly be? Well, I'm glad you asked. Introducing SFRPC, one of the best and most active Southwest Florida roleplay servers out there. Well, what makes them the best out of every other roleplay server? I'm glad you asked. They have several car clubs and in-game jobs for you to participate in, such as FMPD, BSFR, Vorzen, Water Park, Mirage, a car club employee, and even more. They have opportunities for members to gain Robux and money. You looking to be a staff member and get paid? They do it. One Want to be a content creator but don't know where to start sfrpc has a content creator program for small creators trying to make it which offers incentives of 10,000 robux a month i didn't even get that do they have f3x no but i mean that's not the point special rule plays that are hosted end up getting 250 reactions with normal servers getting 100 plus reactions on the weekends and for you role play enjoyers throughout the week they typically get 40 plus reactions on normal sessions during school hours you will almost never find a session that isn't full so this server is active so if you are interested in sfrpc join today with the link in the description apply for civilian and you are set thank you sfrpc for sponsoring this video but it's time to get back can this thing fly yet no it can't fly it, I don't, it, it can't fly it okay our, our goal is to be like this man right here so let's head back back into the garage and customize this thing once again now instead of the engine or anything else you want to actually go to the gearbox and you want to swap this thing to a good old 10 speed for forty thousand dollars now i do have pictures of the gear tuning that will be on screen right now but we're just gonna go ahead and get all these good gear tunes to make it go 200 miles per hour and above <laughs> All right, there we go. We have everything now put down. I mean, this game is a little stupid. I'm not gonna lie. We have to we have to go back through it again because it won't let us actually put down the correct numbers. You have to like put everything down and then go back through it. So let's just do that real quick. Okay. 
There we go. Now we have all the good and correct gear tunes. This thing could go 374 miles per hour. Holy, well, I mean, that's if it ever got up to that. Oh. All right, we're back in game. And there's one last thing that you need to do in order to make this thing fly so you want to head over to your customize and you want to go to the suspension what you want to do is you want to switch this to a custom suspension and you want to copy these these tuned suspensions right here but i forgot them so i need to go and try and find them real quick 10 years later all right i found the tuned suspension pictures will be up on screen right now but what you want to do is you want to go to ride height and you want to switch that all the way over to the front and then you want to switch the rear all the way down see this is what it's gonna look like it's a little funky you want to switch the offset turn that all the way down the camber you also want to turn all the way down the springs you want to turn your stiffness all the way up and leave the dampening how it is and then you want to switch this top speed modifier all the way up to one and now you should be good so if we go out and we drive let's see if this thing can fly here we go let's click t we got we brought up the tune suspension here's what we want to do take this all the way down and then here we go three Two, one, launch it up in the here we go. We're flying, baby. Now it will take just a little bit to like get used to it, but eventually you can bounce back up and then you'll just you just start flying. Oh, let me try one thing. If we do this, we go like that. Look at this. <laughs> We're going all the way up into space. Like this car, this go-kart is so bugged. Oh, what if we hit it off the ramp? Oh my god. I think we can make it to the airport. No, I we, we can make it past the airport. We're not going down right now. Oh my lord. <laughs> oh, uh, I'm pretty sure if you want to turn this thing into like a missile, what you want to do is you want to take the ride height, turn the front, and just turn that all the way down. It should like start bugging out, but I mean, this is how it is, so. Oh, there we go. Uh. Oh, but this thing cannot drive normally. Oh my God. But now that we know this thing can fly, let's go ahead and hop into some races and race some people. This is going to get a little crazy. I can already tell. All right, here we are. We're at our first race. This guy's saying too easy, please. Yeah, right. They do not know what's coming to them. All right, here we go. All right. Three, two, one. Go, 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 go. Like this. Oh, fly. Fly. We're gone. <laughs> no, they're winning. They're winning. He's still behind, though. He's still behind. Go, 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 go. Launch off. Just like so, navigate through. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> this is actually difficult. Launch off. Don't miss it. And go down. We need to go down. We need to go down. There we go. Oh. <laughs> Go, 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 go. Perfect. Now we're just gliding. We're literally just gliding. And I beat a McLaren. I beat a McLaren in this. Where is this bum at? He's gone. He's literally out of existence. Okay, it's you again. You want to see something sick? I'm about to show you the sickest thing that you've ever seen in your entire existence. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. And launch! Too bad this thing isn't that fast. No! It's only good at flying. He missed a checkpoint. He missed a checkpoint. Go! I don't have any boost. No! We were so close to winning. We were exactly like less than 10 seconds off. We're like eight seconds off. We're so close. You know how crazy that is? That's like one of the fastest cars. And we're beating him in our flying car. We're at the three, four mile city drag strip now. We got the same guy again. You know what? We're going to beat him one of these times. No matter how many races it takes. Yeah, look at your stupid freaking car. Okay, we need to put it down. We need to get into launching position. Go, launch, fly. No, no, no. We're only three seconds off. You know how crazy that is? We're so close. Okay, okay. This is the one. Turbine turmoil. This is the one. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's get this into launching position. Here we go. Launch. We're off. We're off. We're off. We don't want to waste too much on my boost. Just like that, we can skip that portion. Got to go down just a little bit. Ooh, baby. Oh, that was actually clean. No! No! <gasps> yes! We need to get back up in the air. Skip, 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 skip. <laughs> yes! Yes! Oh my god! You yeah, did it! We just beat the blade. No way! You see, this car is good for 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 races. Racing. It actually turns so well too in the air. Like I was not 
expecting that at all. So maybe this is like one of the next race cars. I mean, it can only work on a couple races. He just said crazy go-kart. Yeah, I know this thing's crazy. I know this thing is. And for some reason on this car, like the, the, the torpedo thing works. So if we go like super high up in the air and we switch the right eye all the way down, just look. I don't know why it only works on this one, but like, look at that. It's absolutely crazy. And sometimes if you get the torpedo just right, there we go. There we go. Yes. If you get it just right, you'll be able to go all the way up into the air and you'll never... Or, and you'll just, and you'll, and you'll basically just go on forever and ever and ever. Like you're not going back down at all. Like you're, you're not seeing the ground. I, I, you know what? Let's see how high we can get up. Okay, I don't know how far I'm up. I can hardly see the island. It's, it's starting to disappear. Well, I mean, I'm just gonna keep going until like I can't see anything. At all. Um, I'm like, I can hardly see. It. I see a little bit of it, but I'm pretty sure it's just gonna stay like that. So I guess let's just head back down and see how long it takes for me to go back down. Oh. Oh god, this may be a little bit. Oh my god, my speedometer! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god, I see the map. It's right there. Oh, we're almost there, we're almost there. Oh! Oh! I have no clue how long that took. It, it's probably been like, it's probably been a full like 10 minutes. But anyways, I mean, this car is absolutely insane. You can fly with it. You can turn it into the most overpowered car. I mean, the go-kart, it's too overpowered. I mean, that's all I'm saying. Anyways, if you guys did enjoy this video, please make sure to hit that like button and the subscribe button as it does help out the channel a lot. If you did happen to stay this far, let me know what your thoughts on the go-kart is down in the comments. But other than that, I will see you guys later. Peace out, everybody.